keyboard. So, hello everyone. Quickly, I wanted to show you few things about this keyboard with the lights because I've got questions quite often about it. So here we go. So, as it's on default like rainbow, it is correct that you can uh, change these lights without getting the software. All right. So, you have your FN right there. And at the left top corner FN options by default right there. So if I press actually, let me close the lights. There we go. So it's uh, more okay. So it's rainbow as you can see by default. That's the number one. So I'm gonna hold FN and I'm gonna use my other finger. I pressed. FN2 this time. Now it changes its lights completely in a cool way. So beautiful. Now if we press FN once again and pick FN3 this time. <gasps> Look, if you if you press a button, it's going to show lights. Which is really cool and it's not gonna do anything until you press a button. Oh god, I'm doing stuff in the... <laughs> okay. I can't see anything. Where is it? There. Oh fuck, I'm doing things in my... <laughs> there we go. Now I got it on basic from FN and F1. What if we press FN and F4? Nothing happens because that's why these are marked as these are default. And if you want to do more customization, there's the, uh, oh, sorry, a uh, bad angle. You know, the software you can use to uh, play with it. Um, yeah, uh, I ca I've, I've kind of fucked up everything with the laptop right now because <laughs> I've been doing other stuff on my May PC. And yeah, I'm using this keyboard now on a s s different things. So that's why this one is not there. And I'll already explain it. But yeah, I hope this helped you guys. Yeah. Um, yeah, I hope it helped you guys. All right. See you guys. Bye-bye. Happy New Year, by the way.